Hey guys, this is Steven from Credit a la Carte, and in this video I wanted to talk to you about PayPal making a few changes to its business debit card. Uh, so if you like our videos, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so YouTube knows that you want to see all of our videos. So Synchrony Bank, uh, the owner of PayPal, is getting rid of having a credit card as a backup to its business debit card. Now, you might ask why this is kind of important. Uh, the reason being is that there is a way to get 3% cash back on just about every purchase that you make uh, with the business debit card from PayPal. So the business debit card from PayPal gives you a 1% cash back for every purchase that you make. However, what some people have been doing is they realized that PayPal, uh, in, in the PayPal business option, the way the, way the card kind of works is you'd have a balance in your PayPal account. When you swipe your business debit card, it uses that balance. So what happens if you don't have a balance? Well, you would, you would make a backup funding source and that backup funding source you could actually use a credit card for. Uh, luckily enough, one of the options was to use a PayPal personal credit card. Uh, now the PayPal credit card gives you 2% cash back on every purchase that you make. So basically that means that if you were to use your business debit card somewhere, you would earn 1% cash back on your business debit card, but if you don't have a balance, it would default to the 2% uh, cash back credit card. So now you're earning 1% for using the business debit card and then another 2% for using the personal 2% credit card. So now effectively you're getting 3% back. Um, so Synchrony doesn't really like that. I don't think that was really the original intent of uh, <laughs> this. So what are they doing to change this? What are they doing to fix this? Well. In early March of 2019, what they are going to do is they are going to eliminate um, credit card as a backup funding source for the business debit card. Um, instead, what they're going to do is they are going to allow you to use your checking account. I mean, that kind of makes sense to me. That's kind of what a debit card is. It uses your account, right? So that's just kind of the way it goes, I guess. Um, so if, been, if you've been using this method to get 3% cash back on just about every purchase, uh, you have until March, you have until very early March to use, to continue to use this. And um, after that, I mean, that's kind of about it. I don't know if maybe someone will find some other workaround for it, but I want to hold your breath uh, for this method. On the plus side though, you're not getting you're not having to get a business debit card, you're not having to get a PayPal 2% cards. So you basically might be saving yourself a few 524 slots uh, for your credit card strategy. But anyway, if you guys liked our video, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell on YouTube, like the video, uh, you know, the usual, but also make sure to follow us on Instagram and check out our blog at creditalacarte.com where you can kind of see this video in written format. Otherwise, thanks for watching and hope to see you in a future video.